this guy did not have spring break they did not sleep for, for days you know and uh, we consider uh, our lab here the what uh, the, the beach for, for, for the engineers <laughs> massive changes to to we performed better than the last year. So one of the biggest modifications we did was we went from rear wheel drive to front wheel drive because we were having issues with frame parking that was causing the change to derail. That was one of the biggest uh, innovations we did this year. Apart from that, there were different innovations like we put on chain guards, we changed the suspension out so it will handle better off-road. Off we also had different latching, automatic latching system so it unlatches faster, it reduces our assembly time. And um, we also put a we call uh, the, the new springs in the back uh, that will give us better uh, suspension in the back, better articulation in the back. So this year we went with a tandem design which is um, allows us to have a lower center of gravity which means the buggy is more maneuverable. We also have independent front and rear suspension which means we have a smoother ride, um, the chassis and the everything else is going to get you know um, pushed around a lot because of the suspension system. We have all of our drivetrain is guarded. Um, that's a new innovation this year. Um, they're really interested in dust abatement on the moon, so that was a new feature. Um, we have four-wheel braking. We have um, really robust suspension system and a telescoping frame. Our, um, our buggy has to fold up into a four-foot cube, so we chose to have a telescoping frame so that it compacts itself and it folds up really easily. Uh, this is very telescopic because they require when they get there to and this is folded they require to unfold it you know in thir 30 seconds this was this why they made this telescopic and they have here different design you know to click it and so that to overcome this problem. A lot of really tight turns um, and then there's a lot of uh, there's like sand pits uh, pea gravel pits and they have like um, really steep I guess ramps and craters to go through um, and a lot of people have a hard time with uh, just parts just breaking just from sheer impact so uh, you know and then there's a you know a hill probably doesn't sound like too much of an obstacle but for a lot of these teams their buggies are so light they actually get to going so fast that uh, you know they hit it their chassis breaks people fly off and you know people have gotten hurt doing this so um, so yeah <laughs>